Hey, it's our tech guy here. Um, so today we're going to be updating the portable solar kit and I got these uh, 12 volt outlets for the portable solar kit. Uh, hopefully it'll focus on that. If not, oh well, I'll show you later. I bought these on Amazon. I'll post the links up for this stuff and, and other things I use. I didn't really see a need for this uh, portable solar kit before, but now that I'm doing a lot of different uh, recordings like for RF Kids TV and RF Tech Guy, I need to charge my equipment and this is going to come in very handy and then these 12 volt outlets are going to help a lot. That way I don't even have to use the inverter. Let's get this party started. So, we should put this about right there. So I'm going to put this uh, fuse, it's a 10 amp fuse, I'm going to put it on the positive wire. Um, I still need to make a hole in the bottom of this thing. Let me move my water. In order to run the wires through, we need to put a hole down here. That should be good. So now I can run the wire through here. So now we got all the wiring on the inside pretty much done. Now we can attach these.
This is horrible. This is for beating. So here's where I got the 10 amp fuse. Um, sorry, you can't see that. Here's where I got the 10 amp fuse. And I'm glad I put this here because that wiring mistake that I made, this 10 amp fuse uh, kind of saved me from melting these 14 gauge wires. Um, so I got the positive going from this side because I had this side was a little overcrowded with the connections and then I got the negative coming from this side and that's going into the 12 volt uh, outlets so I got my 12 volt outlets here and then I got a, a meter actually let me uh, I'm gonna plug in my plug this into the solar real quick Not much I could do about the background noise, sorry about that. So now I got this charging off the sun. I got about 50 watts of solar panels that I carry with me at all times. Well, in the Jeep, which is where I take this thing. So when I'm recording, I'll be taking this thing and my solar panels with me. And this is only 2.1 amp. So this works for like uh, devices like phones. It's a slow, kind of a slow charge. But as you can see here, I turn this on. And this, this phone is dead, but it's charging now. So we're going to let that charge. So as you can see here, the voltage is going up because I plugged the solar in. Thank you for watching RF Tech Guy. Be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I will be leaving some links down below on where you can get this 12 volt charger and this whole uh, kit here. So I got two devices charging off of this. Um, I actually have faster chargers in my inside the Jeep, which is like uh, 3.0 chargers. Uh, they they plug into this 12 volt outlet. Now I was going to get a, a 3.0 USB outlet, but uh, it was like $16, and I already went over budget, so. Uh, we're going to save that for another time.